Hi everyone, thanks for watching. This is a video about using a four point grade scale in Infinite Campus. We talk to our students about the importance of focusing on learning in our classes, but too many times based on how we grade and what they hear from us, all they think about are points in our classes and students are getting mixed messages. We want them to focus on learning, but in reality, the way we operate, they end up focusing on the points. And I think part of the problem is that we try to get our grades to do too many things. We try to get our grades to show a student's learning, their behavior. We should try to think about focusing on one thing with our grades. And if it's got to be one thing, that one thing should be understanding. But how do we get students to think more about learning than accumulating points in Infinite Campus? The way I've tried doing this is using a four-point scale in my gradebook. Everything in Infinite Campus is, uh, is worth four points. And students get feedback on their level of understanding for each assignment. And each point level is really just a level of understanding. And the way I've done this in Infinite Campus is I've had to change the grade settings a little bit. So for an assignment like this, where students had to blog and write a little paragraph, in Infinite Campus, I've weighted that assignment at a 0.3 multiplier weight. So it's a lot, it's not worth as much, but the point value, the point that they see is four. It's worth four points. However, an assignment like this where students had to build a website and explain the kind of working conditions they want to see when they leave high school, that is also worth four points, but the weight is much higher on that one because it was a much bigger project. It took several weeks to finish that one. So that is how I'm getting my students to focus more on learning than points. Thanks very much for watching, and if you want to talk more about this, please let me know.